Alrighty then, good afternoon everybody, uh, Silver Dragon here, coming at you with some more Timber and Stone. Going to be continuing where we last left off. Now, of course, last time we did finally uh, add in that lovely little mod pack that allows us to uh, make a few uh, little changes. Also, apparently we are in water. What the hell? That is totally the wrong save. Whoops. I completely loaded the wrong save. That is my fault. I didn't even know that save still existed. Ta Combined mod loaded. Now, last time I had thought that... I'm like, which one of these did I load? I thought excessive failure was my... There we go. For some reason, I loaded up the Dragonlands when I meant to load up excessive failure. My bad. My bad. Oh, well. So, yes. Excuse me. So as I was saying, last time we loaded the, uh, what is it? Bob is Back Combined Mod Pack, version 1.7. Uh, which gave us a lot of nice little additions, including an actual, uh, actual much better, uh, fast forward key here, as it were. The ability to key each individual one of my units to, uh, the number key, number keys, which was quite useful for locating my military personnel and giving them commands. Apparently, just one is being used right now to get us to stick. I don't have anyone else under that right now. Now, we got to figure out this damn mystery here today if I can. I think I'm even going to make bricks just in the hope that they will uh, use that since stone is not is clearly not working. It's a processed resource. Brick. Alright. Let's have him make 40 brick for us. Oh, hey! And then all these skeletons and such just kind of collapsed onto the floor. Tch. Now, what are my units doing right now? Uh, most of them are mining at the moment. None of them are wood chopping. We had gained enough trees for the moment. Let's go ahead and page down. Let's see how many layers I actually have above me here. So I have at least 9 or 10 layers above me where I can actually still construct something. So I could still construct a small hut around this place. Whoops. Oops, let's go ahead and mine this out right here. They should be able to build up everything else. What the hell? Oh, that I went to the nearest character who is not doing anything, which in this case is apparently you, madame. Alright, let me page up and see what you're doing right now. What is your job? You are the tailor. You have nothing to do, really? Um, yeah, we are out of... Uh, in that case, I have an idea. Rosalie. I want you to go farm for me. If you don't mind. Or actually... Where's my herder? Oh, it's actually Stick here, who is our farmer. I'm going to have him get to work on that for a second. Weapon storage is low again. Oh, hey, somebody new joined. A miner, level 3 miner. Also a level 3 farmer and a level 3 forager. I think I'm going to have him... I'm going to have him farm right now because we need more farmers. Welcome, Emma, to Excessive Failure. May your death be swift and painless. Farmer. There you go. Get to farming, less. Now let me actually go into my design. Livestock pens. Farms. Here we go. Potato farm. Corn farm. And we're going to destroy the wheat farm right here and replace it with corn. Just so that we have more food being produced. Alright, we have one flax, two corn, and whatever the hell this is. Turnip or something. Pretty sure that's turnip. Yes. Should be. Alright, so he's doing a good job. What do you have in your inventory? What are you getting? So he is getting wool, he's getting food, feathers, at long last. 
He's also apparently wearing chain mail and such. Ah, uh, yeah, Stick is our uh, soldier for now. Well, both the trousers have been filled, so that's a good thing. Let's go ahead and go into storage here for a second. Hmm. What am I looking for? Weapons. Weapon rack. I'm just going to throw it here in our storage pile area. Looks like she's building something. What are you digging? What are you building? Ah, that's what you're building. So it'll be a while before she actually gets around to, uh, well, that's the blacksmith, not the, who's my stone engraver then? Speaking of which, we're out of that, so I need my stone uh, masonry now. Janorkin, get your ass up here, man. We got many tools for you to construct. Oh, it's a spider. I think I need to assign somebody to go foraging. Stick has done with his job for the most part. Depositing all the food. Let's see. Looks like he's still harvesting some more. So I'll let him continue to harvest for now. As he, we are getting a good amount of food, feathers, and everything else for that. Uh, once he's done, I will get him farming once again. And I'll have Rosa go and start butchering up those uh, bodies here. So we can get whatever resources we can from them. Now... This is our problem here at the moment for construction. I was using, where was it, great stone as my building material here, but for whatever reason, they are refusing to build with it. I don't know why. It's like, it is a material that just uses stone. Uh, part of it, I'm sure right now, is I don't have anybody assigned to build, but even then, I did have them before, and they still weren't doing it. Builder. Here we go. You're doing carpentry right now. Let me temporarily have you go back to building. There he is. One simply does not do this job without a hoe. Where the hell is our stonemason I just reassigned? There he is. He is too busy making that right now. Oh, you damn fool. I'm going to remove that here so he can get to work. There we go. Now he can actually build tools. Silly fool. Now, where is he? I don't have enough inventory space to build a block. Okay. The hell are you doing right now? Oh, I see what he's doing. He's building all the blocks down here. So he was getting all of this done, essentially. Not the other stuff I was trying to get him to do. Dig mine. Which again, points to me that he's just not seemingly uh, capable of doing that job that I asked him to do. From what I can see, he just will not replace that stuff properly. Or he won't he won't build that section of the wall, and I just don't know why. Yes, I know. What the hell is this guy? What the hell is he doing? Whoops. Resume. Cancel design. I think, I'm pretty sure he's doing it right now. Yep, he's building a bunch of everything. Not quite building what we need right now, but he is building things. Alright, let's go ahead and speed this up. <coughs> Five times. Let's go six times. Let's max this baby out. Oh, it's not letting me. Oh, there we go. Six times. Oh, stop. So, stick, you can get back to work farming. If we have the proper tools for it. 
Of course, just like I thought, Walker Boy has stopped his job without actually coming down here to construct anything. So again, I'm kind of like, well, what the hell is your damn problem? Why do you refuse to build this wall? So in that case, since he refuses, let's try building it out of castle brick. Maybe if I try building it with brick, it might work. It's going to look awkward in the fact that I'm going to have a wall made up of two different materials. But frankly, if the damn thing actually gets built that way, then at least, you know, it gets built. I have eight bricks, so more than enough to complete the task. And Walker Boy is not doing anything. So yes, I don't know what is going on with that wall, but it will not be built. More than likely. For whatever reason, it refuses to be built. Alright, Walker Boy. Go ahead and get back to carpentry then. Since you are useless to me as a builder, just get back to carpentry work. It's a damn shame. Oh well, it is what it is. Nothing surprises me anymore with that. I don't know, maybe if I loaded a new map it'd be different. It's just weird though, the entire wall, the whole other rest of the wall, went up with no problem, but this section just will not be built. Boggles my mind a little bit. Construction. Great stone. Hmm. Oh, I see what the problem is here. We are still one level below that as well. We're going to try going like this then. And see if that will help. If they will at least build this upper layer, then at least it's semi-complete. And we can just pretend that a giant freaking rock or something hurled into the side of this thing. Thereby creating that hole. Let me go into the unit list here and see if I can just assign... Let's assign the new person to building and see if they will go do that for me. Janorkin, what are you doing? You are the stonemason. You are done your stonemasoning. In that case, go assist the farmers. Go assist the farmers for now. I think I also had you mining before, but just go assist the farmers. Let's go downstairs, see how we're doing. This can be removed now just by mining it. All right, let's go objects, furniture, large table, get another large table over on the other side here. All right, design, mine. See if I can have them mine that out. Also, I think I want them. Whoops. I want them to mine this back one more. Might need to get them some scaffolding to do it though. Oh good, they are starting with the top. So they can reach up to two tiles up it seems. That's not too bad. That's not too bad at all. Ah, Spato. Let's see here. Hey, Emma's doing some work. Let's see what she's doing. Looks like, uh, just like I thought, she is building the upper layer. But, for whatever reason, will not build the lower layer. Hmm... It's not like there's a tree underneath here or something that's stopping that from spawning. I really have no idea what's causing that. Weirdness. Whatever, as long as we get that built, we can assume someone just sieged us. And all will be well with the world. <laughs> that's, what I'm, that's what I'm going under the assumption. Also, this tree is freaking huge. Holy shit, this tree. Of mature fir tree. Goddamn. 
I like, I definitely like how this place is looking now that I've added trees to it. How are you doing? What are you building now? Ah, she's building up the uh, helmets, the brute helmets. Hopefully she'll be getting on those damn gladiuses soon, because I really would like, would much rather have a uh, stick equipped with a gladius than the short sword that he is currently uh, using. I would also like to actually get him training on being a soldier, so I want to give him additional skills in that regard. There we go. Uh, okay. So hopefully now the gladiuses will be constructed. Now where is my carpenter? There he is. Walker boy is making more stone arrows. Last time I said bodkin arrows, but I meant stone arrows. That we want to construct in bulk. I would love to have the bodkin arrows, but they also use up uh, ore, and I would rather not waste that ore. Go farmers, go. How is our actual food supply right now? Uh, not too bad, but it needs to be a lot better than that. I believe somebody said each each worker uses up 30 units of food or something like that. So if I want to get more people, I need to increase the food supply significantly. So yeah, it's made of the same material. I just have no idea why they refuse to build that. It's a mystery. Oh, hey. Hello. Let's mine that out. Actually, I should have a couple of those around here, shouldn't I? Could I oh, nice. Janorkin is now a level 9 farmer. Let me also have this get mined out. Don't know why that's still like that. Um, got a couple of these kind of spots here. Oh, hey, I actually grew a tree directly on top of that coal vein. Ha! <laughs> nice. All right. Other than that, there doesn't appear to be too many big gaps, except maybe this thing. Uh, it's not horrendous, but yeah. But anyway, essentially any of the spiders can climb up this anytime they want. So this will not protect me from the brood mother, as it were. Even, even if I were to build walls this high up or like all along the entire length of this, it would not protect me from that at all. Uh, okay. How goes the farm there, lads? It's like, I keep thinking, oh man, my fence disappeared. What's going on here? What's happening? But it's just, it's page down one level. <laughs> I don't have enough inventory space to continue to work. Here, let me fix that for you, homie. There you go. Rosalie. Now, if I actually send her or any of them out doing... Actually, I think I need to send her out, don't I? Yes, I do. She's a level 8 forager. So I need her to go quickly harvest these guys. I really don't want her gathering anything. Good. She's not set to gather any, berry, any berries or anything at all. So she's disposing of the dead and looting the dead. That is all she is doing right now. Gather resources, uh, gather resources, holy crap, we have a whole load of skeletal bodies over here, which I probably should especially get rid of, because I do not know, I'm assuming that if a necromancer were to show up, he would be able to resurrect these skeletons, thereby greatly increasing the need to remove uh, any skeletal corpses from your area after you've dealt with him. Or face the risk of a possible double skeleton army. Oh, damn. She quick. Pretty sure she's already cleared off, like, every job I have for her there. Except for maybe the spider. She's still got to go over there and butcher that spider. That's about it. Yep, yeah, she's heading over there right now, actually, to gather the resources from that. So we'll get a bit of webs and whatever. How are we doing downstairs? Let's take a look. Uh, not too bad, not too bad. The bedrooms are being constructed quite well. The gladiuses are being done. Uh, let's see here. Objects and objects. Construction, terrain, stone. Alright, let's uh, begin actually building up here. So, objects, furniture. 
Blanketed beds. Comfortable beds. We don't have cotton, though. Or do we have cotton seeds? We have no cotton seeds. Alright, fine. We'll just go blanketed beds, then. Eh, it's unsymmetrical. I'm sure that's going to drive some people nuts. Blanketed bed. I just realized this is backwards. Alright, let me also go back a bit. Whoops. Objects create some brace doors. Or not brace doors, just timbered doors. I'll make it so that they open inwards. Perfect. So, so far, we're only digging out six bedrooms. We're obviously going to need to expand that all the way. But my miners are currently working at their peak efficiency. So once they've cleared out this area, then I will move on to the next and the next and so on. And I might actually create a stairway either at the end or maybe I'll do it right next to this or something to go down to the next level. Yeah, I'll probably do it like off to the right here. I don't know. We'll see how this goes. I have to say, for, dwar for a Dwarf Fortress light, this one does a pretty damn good job. You know, there's a lot... Oh, you fool. What have you done? Damn girl went and trapped herself. Can I get... Is the carpenter going to do that, or... What is your current job? He's building the doors. Well, we'll just speed this up till he's done that. Maybe he'll go... I'm not sure if it's a builder, or... Let me take one of the miners for a second, see if they can go finish that up for me. They can go free their companion. Save your friend! Save them! Ooh, also we have a lot more thread now. Who the hell is that? Oh, hey, Rosalie's done. Fantastic. I think he went downstairs to repair the other shit that I hadn't intended him to be repairing. Yep, I thought so. He went downstairs to patch up all the holes. Oh, Jerry. Oh, Jerry. It's not Jerry. Who the hell is my builder? My other builder. Oh, there he is. So he's finishing up that job, but he's not... Okay, let me try making you a carpenter then. What am I low on storage now? Weapon storage again? This is being problematic. Sadly, I cannot con er, upgrade that one. This is going to be slightly problematic. I might have to have her destroy a tile so she can get out of there. Since it seems like they are refusing to uh, go build that scaffolding. And that was not where I wanted to build that. God damn it. There we go. I would think you would be able to get up there, but you're not. Let me get one of the miners. Uh, let me get you back to mining. And slow this down a little bit. Let me have him go over there. He should be able to mine that tile. That will allow him to escape. And hopefully problem solved. I'll have to rebuild it. And well, at least they won't be stuck anymore. That's only if he decides to do the job, though. There we go. Excellent. 
Congratulations, you are free. You are free! Let's get that reconstructed. Let's see here. One, two, three, four. So it will actually be that high. Excellent. All right, so she has been freed. All is well with the world, and we will see how things go from here. How you doing, Walker boy? Ooh, he is almost a level 11. Excellent. And the knife has been constructed. Weapons. So the compound bow... Which, actually, there's no point in making the compound bow. So, quite literally, I need level 17 to do anything further with bows. Because, honestly, an extra 2.5 range is, you know, decent, I guess. But the fact that it uses up a fur or leather, just like, no. No, no thank you. Alright, let's take a look at the inventories for people. And let me take a look at the ones who are actually maintaining arrows okay good so he has a self bow so paisley is the only one currently maintaining anything emma you will be the next how many are you can are you maintaining i'll have you also maintain 30 arrows nice also, what are you maintaining other than that light chest? I might see about getting you guys some light helmets and such as well, if I haven't already. I will have to look into that. So one other thing that I do want constructed over here that I have not actually gotten around to yet. Let me just get this wall built quickly. Uh-oh, we got wolves. Unit list, Paisley. Oh, Paisley. Now, oh, unit list, let me get to you quickly. I'm actually going to assign you... Where the hell are you? Are you down below? Yes, you were down below. So, control two. So, he is now assigned to two. I love that so much. That is something that almost... They should just put that into the main game. Rather than it needing to be a mod. So, I'm just going to have him immediately run up here. Yeah, it comes the wolf pack. Let's see how this new self bow behave. Self bow behaves. That's a hit. Let's see if Emma is going to. What the hell are you doing, Walker boy? Oh, Emma, you fool. Are you a melee? Yeah, I have you. I gave you a weapon, didn't I? No, surprisingly, I did not. Kind of like, what the hell are you doing? Okay, that was a little weird. At least we have a great range right now. Great sight range. I think he's going to put away some stuff. Oh, hey, they're finally getting around to mining that. Ha! That took a long time. Dear Lord. All right, so as I was saying before I got horribly distracted, uh, another thing I want to construct up here is some weapon and... Is weapon different or ammo? No, well, actually, I should have done that here already. Uh, so we're going to put weapon storage, like, literally up here. That way they can quickly access... Uh, their additional ammo if they need to. Actually, let's put that, put that on the inner kind of, let's even put it right here actually. Yeah, let's put it like this. 
that's perfect. Now let me go back in the designs, constructions, walls, great stone. And that will stretch all the way to here. Perfect. Excellent. With that done, we will be able to retrieve arrows from that location from now on. Now, I highly, highly doubt there were two wolves. So I'm going to send the archer out here for a moment. This seems like a good location off to the side. It's almost a mini archer tower in and of itself. What are you doing? Let me check your orders. Resting. Let me look at your options here. Walk and patrol routes. So yes, this was a problem. This is your guard position for the moment. Stay there. Let's see here. Uh, okay. Do I have to assign it as a guard position somewhere? Yes. I apparently have to assign it as a guard position. I can also assign a patrol route. Actually, probably what I'll end up doing eventually is I'll just build a patrol route along the wall, and that'll be what they do. For now, though, I'll, I'll set up that guard position. That's right, get your ass to the patrol or to the guard route. Yeah, bloody wanker. Although, honestly, we haven't been attacked again, so more than likely the wolves have found something else to attract their attention for the moment. Also, it's nighttime, so I can't see shit. Now, that wasn't what I was looking for, though. Objects. Lighting is what I'm looking for. That requires... I think that's fat. Twine. We have a wall sconce. Requires level 5. That requires level 7, which we have definitely do not have. This requires us to build a torch and a metal block. Come on. So I cannot build that higher. That's a little annoying. Huh. I can see why. Mm, construct, terrain, stone. There we go. Because this one is higher than that, we cannot build the wall sconce on the wall properly. So I will rebuild this in order to get up there and put that in place. That way we'll at least have a little bit of better lighting. But we also require torches for that. Which is not something that I've actually bothered to make. Requires cloth and fat, yes. Let's make four of those. I wonder what the big lamp looks like, though. Lamp post. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. Imagine if I had one of those on either side like this. That would be fantastic. Yeah, I can't because this is a guard position right now. But I definitely want to get one of these eventually. We have other cool little things, of course, like... Uh, Ooh, speaking of which, who is our best engineer? We do have a level 3 engineer currently working as a blacksmith. That's a tough decision. Well, once she's done with the blacksmithing, which should be fairly soon, hopefully. She's doing too damn good as a blacksmith right now for me to have her do something else. Alright, let me get Sparrow back to work. Or... Sparrow? Or who the hell was it? No. Paisley. 
Get back to mining, Paisley. I think the smith has run out of things to do. I know. Well, what is the torch? Who builds the torch? Oh, that's a level that's a level 4 engineer's ability. Okay then, congratulations. You have now upgraded to engineer. We don't have the materials to craft the archery target. We don't. We don't what? Oh, this this is problematic, is it not? Unit list. Let's see here. Where's my tailor? I'm always, it's, it's hilarious. I'm spending 90% of my time looking around for people. Like, where's this guy? What's that guy doing? What the hell's going on here? God. Uh, I swear. I swear. How much does this do we have? We have 20 animal fur. We have a crap ton of fiber. Let's have her maintain 30 of that. And now we just speed up time. So until that then, Little Miss Miner slash Engineer slash everything else, go mine. Go ahead and mine. Speaking of which, I better get my stonemason back. Stone ma wow, I'm just ripping everyone from farming. I swear. Farming is like the... the uh, the job that gets done the least here, it seems, just because of all the times I'm having to steal people away from it. <laughs> it's freaking hilarious. Alright. Ah, one more. Yeah, it's only one block out. So I need her to build this up here so I can go ahead and establish that where I want it. Right now, one block. That is two blocks in. S oh damn it. There we go. It's like screw the details. Screw the details. How are we doing here? Well she's busy making cloth first. Now she's making twine. Good. Oh, she's making twine and immediately turning it into cloth. There we go. That's good enough. You do not need to maintain any more of that right now. Thank you. Just get the twine built. Appreciate it. No wonder we ran out of... Holy shit. No wonder we ran out of fiber so quickly. She's already gone through half of it. Dear God. And on the plus side, she's now a level 12 tailor. Frack yeah. Let's see what a level 12 tailor can construct. That's a level 9 tailor. Level 14 tailor can make the uh, Brigadine, which would be our damn good... Uh... Oh, that'd be fantastic. She's getting close. The rest is blacksmithing. The breastplate, the curious, requires level 20 blacksmith. Arming cap, level 4 tailor. This is all blacksmith, blacksmith, blacksmith. Ha! Huh? These little mini boots require a level three. <laughs> That's funny. Leather boots. I could make a bunch of leather boots. So how many? Oh, I have nowhere near enough leather for that. Level eight stonemason. Thought we had created a bunch of that. Hmm. Kite shield. Let's queue up a kite shield. So literally, we're getting close, but yeah. Let's pause for a second. Resources. Did you make what I needed you to make? You made me 30 twine. In that case, make it, uh, make it 40 twine. And who are you? Walker boy. You were doing carpentry. And you ran out of stuff to do? Huh. You probably did, too. How are we doing right here? So these have been cleared out. They've done a pretty good job when I wasn't looking. They've almost completely dug this out. Whoops. 
I'm meant to rotate the camera, but that's not quite what I'm doing here, it seems. Okay, go back. Objects, furniture, blanketed bed. Wait. That's reversed again. It's hard to see the whole, like, pillow there. Uh, if I build that here right now, I won't be able to actually finish that up, will I? Alright, let's get some timber doors. Okay. They're not swinging in and out like they usually do. Maybe because I have the game paused. Yeah, it's because I have the game paused. Alright. Now let's go back again. Furniture. We just got plain old wooden chairs. Let's get a whole bunch of them. Actually, what am I doing? Hold shift. Right to move around and shift. Fantastic. Fireplace requires 12 of those bricks. Let's get some dressers. Perfect. That'll keep him busy for a while. I definitely want to get some of those constructed though. I'll cancel the ones on the ends here. It looks weird. Alright, what the hell is that damn pig doing down here? Somebody domesticate that thing and then murder it. Okay. So we should have enough for this now, so let's get our blacksmith back to work. Engineer. Janorkin, what are you doing? You are the stonemason. Get back to farming. Thank you for constructing all the tools. I probably should have him start, because to be honest, I should probably maintain like eight of them or plus at this point. Just so that they have a lot. How are we doing over here? Looking good, looking good. Now I just gotta get access to the actual bloody uh, large gate and I can complete this. Design. Objects. Yes, lighting, wall sconce. Excellent. All right. How are we doing here? She's doing her job. These are being made. Military. And thus we begin grinding out her engineer skill. By mass placing all of these. However, this one we're just going to rebuild when broken. Actually, both of these will be rebuilt once broken. Unit list. you I'm like where the hell is infantry on this now I am so blind stick as my only level 2 infantryman I wish you to go train yourself also good he upgraded to his gladius uh, let's see 
combat training. Get to work, buddy. We'll see if he actually does it or not. Yep. He is working on it. Fantastic. And thus it begins. Level 3 infantryman. Let's go ahead and take a look at you. Oh, Claudia. So she's currently level four. She's so she already just now leveled up to a level, uh, to a fourth level, freaking hell engineer. So each one she builds at the moment. Let's see here. She's about halfway. So each one she builds, she's jumping up about ten percent. Probably a little bit under that, but I'm just going to say roughly 10%. So, if that maintains, it will probably take me building like 100 of these things to actually get her leveled up. Probably. I doubt that's going to be maintained, though. How are we doing on food? We are doing really badly on food right now. Because I keep reassigning all of our, uh, all of our farmers. Emma's building. Once she's done building, she'll be back to farming. I'm pretty sure she's close, too. The hell was that? Yeah, literally, she's got a last little bit here to go, and then she's good to go. How are we doing with these? Ooh. Herder. Is currently in the infantry, and he leveled up too, which is fantastic. Sorry, buddy. I keep shifting every. I keep shifting all the guys' jobs. That's a problem. That's probably the biggest problem is that I keep having to constantly change all of their jobs. Yeah, is it just me or does she kind of look like Sephiroth a bit right, a bit right now? <laughs> uh, anyway. Just need to give her a very long katana. Page up. Let's get our fencing. Ooh, we're actually down to 193 wheat. I may end up having to reestablish that. How is our seeds for wheat, actually? We have 12. That's not too bad. Flax, we got a ton. Same thing for corn. We're like drowning in it practically. Oh, well, this will give us a nice quick boost in food. Let's go ahead and just max this out for now. Super speed time. All right, you are pretty much done, girl. Yep, get to farming. And it's about time I get our stonemason back temporarily. Who is also a farmer. <laughs> That's the worst part about it is that all of my important guys are also farmers. That's why we're constantly running out of the tools for farming. Or not for farming, but uh, yeah, you know what I mean. Hand tools. And lag. Let's get... Let's go ahead and make 10 stone hoes, that way... Okay, I guess we're good to go then. Stick is done hurting. Get back to being infantry for a little bit, my friend. Thank you. Oops, let's pause. So this was all dealt with. Now I just gotta go through the whole chain again. Training dummy 172. 
173. All right, design objects, military, training dummies. I guess these also do use that up. Almost wish I could just stretch a line of these. Then again, I wish I could also delete them in a line. That would make things efficient. But it, it's it's is it not sad though that this is the best way and pretty much the only way to level up their skills? The fact that we have to keep building and destroying like a million of these. There's got to be a better way. I mean, they they should really come up with something for that. Waka boy, what you doing? You are the carpenter. Oddly enough, you have nothing to do. Oh yes, you finally finished the job I had given you. Rosa. Should be tailoring, but I guess she's all done right now. So in that case, get back to farming. Get back to farming. How are we doing down here? Ugh, it's definitely really dark though. That's, that's a downside. Objects? No, not objects. Construction, terrain, stone. Thank you. Now let's go ahead and patch up all these lovely little holes that I made. That's kind of a pain in the ass having that up there. Okay, back please. Objects, furniture. Blanketed bed. A little bit easier to see it from here, isn't it? Let's also get a dresser on the right side. They're still working on this bit right here. We don't have a builder right now, so they won't even be able to patch all these holes. Uh, construct terrain, stone. Whoops. Right click. Let's get save the game for a second there. Alright, hopefully. Ooh, that's not correct either, is it? No, it most certainly was not. And actually, let's mine that out while we're at it. Unit list. Emma, please get back to building for a moment. Now a level 6 engineer. Huh. At least my soldier can keep working at that. So she's getting there. She is getting there. It's pretty good already being level 6. So she went from level 3 to level 6 in a fairly short amount of time. But it still sucks that this is the method we have to use for that. Uh... Alrighty then. So he's just going to keep whack, whack, whacking away. He'll be hopefully pretty damn skilled eventually. Ten odds beyond my skill. Oh, are they finally getting out here to mine all of this? Yeah, they're finally getting out here to mine all this stuff. Of course, the most of them are going for the copper and such right now because they don't have the level to uh, work on the good stuff. Wait, is that corn or wheat? That looks like wheat to me, but I destroyed that and turned it into a corn farm. Weird. Oh, Jerry. What are you doing, Jerry? Don't you be picking fights with the spider people. Nice. Level 9 farmer. Excellent. All is going well for the most part then it seems. Ah, oh, let's see here. What am I missing? What am I missing? I know I'm missing something. Well, she is the correct level now to be making the torches. The torches have been made. Which means I can assign her to be a blacksmith once again. Pretty shortly. And she can go and construct all of those sconces. 
I also do plan on building some on the uh, inside as well. And of course, some of the fireplaces for which I need some additional materials. Speaking of which... I require a lot more blocks. Alright, resources. Go ahead and build me, oh, let's say 60 of those, please. And that is the job of, I believe, yes. So once again, my poor friend, I must rip you away from farming. I know, I know, I'm a monster. Where's Emma? Okay, she's done with that. Go back to farming, please. Thank you. You're not exactly the best replacement for the guy that was lost, but yeah, you'll do. You will do. Again, that is really in the way, all that stuff up there. <laughs> mind that, mind that. Let's get rid of all this junk. Wish I could take a more first person look at everything here. All right. Uh, objects, furniture. Let's go ahead and get the blanketed beds in here. Hmm, dresser. Rotate. Doors, timbered door. Perfect. Eventually, let's go into furniture again. Fireplace. Yeah, we'll put them like this then. Even though it looks a bit weird. So we'll have two large fireplaces right there to warm this place up. It's also a good reason not to have that chair there because that would have blocked it completely. Let's get some large bookcases in here as well. This will be where we come to eat, drink, read. It's our dining hall, our library, our place to escape the winter chill. Obviously, there's a one tile difference on either side, or on this side, I should say. So I should have mined one more tile over here, but meh, oh well. Oh well, it is what it is. I wonder where those will poke up. Ah, those will poke right through the... Oh, we had enough, too. <laughs> oh, no! Our wagon is on fire! Uh, I should really go and uh, produce some storage here. So, treasure is going to need 40 storage. Weapons are probably good. Armor is definitely going to need some more storage here soon. Storage coin pile. Let's get a couple of treasure chests built. I'll put them down here somewhere. At least one of them I'll put right here. The other one, oh, let's hide it back here. That'll give us the 40 we need for that. Armor stockpile, armor chest. That requires a blacksmith. And we'll just slap that right here. That should be sufficient. Oh, are you out of tools again? Yes, you're out of tools. Temporarily remove the brick job so that he can actually build what they need. Deconstruct. Oh, well, at least he's working hard. I wonder what level he is right now for uh, infantry. And there we go. All right. 
I know, I know, I know. Oh, he's level 7 infantry. Not bad, not bad at all. Nope. Objects, military. Let's get some additional training dummies. Yeah, let's go ahead and replace that. And there we go. That should get her up to God only knows. What level is she right now? Oh, Claudia. So she's level six blacks or blacksmith. She's level six engineer. What do I need her to be? In order to construct the castle arch gate, she needs to be a level seven engineer. So she's actually really close to that. The full on castle gate is also level seven. I'm actually surprised it's that low, so we're already going to be almost building that, ironically enough. Okay, so where the hell is the guy that's supposed to be producing your hose? Waka boy! No, Jorkin, where are you? What are you doing? Why are you not making hose? I don't understand what's with him. Weird, he should be making that right now. Uh, one second. Alrighty then, apologies about that. Took a bit longer than I expected. Alright, let's see here. Let's get back to this. Uh, so, Janorkin, why are you not doing your job? Uh, let's see here. Um, I might know why. Resources, raw materials. We have enough raw wood. We have enough everything. So there should be no reason why he is not building picks. Oh, weird. For some reason, it's not set to maintain anymore. Uh, in that case, let me go back into the resources. You know what? To hell with it. To hell with it. Make me 20. So for whatever reason, it stopped maintaining. I don't know why. It's kind of weird, but yeah. Yeah, we definitely have to remove this wagon. Also, I think I'm going to use some of this for the carpenter. Design. Go on a door. Yeah, let's make a brace door. Let me actually hit play here so I can see what the hell's going on with it. Good, it opens outwards. All right. Hmm. Timbered brick. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. So we're gonna construct it like so. Once that's done, I'm going to kind of do a... Actually, you know what? Let's make this too high. We'll make the back wall and everything else here at least too high. All right. Farming seems to be going well. Let me get a bunch of the miners working on other things, though. The, the low-skill miners can go help farm. Or you know what? I'll even let you fish. 
Yeah, do we have any... Let me take a look at my tools here. I haven't built any fishing rods. Build me three fishing rods, please. Thank you. Thank you, good sir. Also, where's my builder? Ah, yes. She is currently farming. Again, I must steal one of my farmers. <laughs> oh, damn. Alright, now in order to construct some of the even cooler shit though, let me go back into design and objects for a second. So, seeds craft wise, in order to make a ballista, I need a level 12 freaking uh, engineer. But then again, how useful would the ballista be? Pretty much in any game like this that I've ever seen a ballista used, including Dwarf Fortress actually, it's been mildly useless to be honest. Uh, same thing could be said for the catapult in uh, Castle Story and so on and so forth. Any fixed siege weaponry that I've ever seen used in defense has been completely useless. The hell are you doing out there? Oh yeah, I know what you're doing out there. Never mind. Uh, but what else? We got the lighting. The lamp post requires level 7. So 7 seems to be the tier where you can finally start just going to town with it. Trying to think, we've already gotten most of this. Artisan workbench. Do I even have an artisan workbench? I do not have an artisan workbench. Huh. Well, let's go ahead and fix that, shall we? Where do I want to chuck this artisan workbench? Better question, where is there room to chuck this artisan workbench? <laughs> let's throw it right here. Requires a level 10 carpenter. Carpenter we have. Builder we also have. Hopefully I'll be getting that done. Pause for a second. What level are you now, Claudia? You are now the level 7 I needed. Fan-freaking-tastic. In that case, let's go ahead and deconstruct and remove all of this. By mining this, this will be removed. Objects. Doors. Let's just use Castle Gate. Uh, hit play. Perfect. That's still in the way, though. So that has to be removed before I can place it. So that one looks like that. How about the castle arch gate? No, that looks... I would have to literally build an arch that looks perfect for that. I may also have to destroy the road underneath. Potentially. go ahead and speed this up because they're taking freaking forever thank you good sir appreciate it nice all right go get her built then I can train you or train you put you back into a blacksmith Do not have the materials to craft the castle gate. What does it require? Strong timber. Resources. Process material. And now we do. Hmm. That was an odd rumbling. If you don't mind, old bean, go ahead and domesticate that sheep for me. Also, butcher that boar. I want some leather. 
I'm aware of that. Give him time. He will be constructing it shortly. At least I hope he will be. Huh. Resources, strong timber. What is the requirement? Level 10, we have it. He's just too busy eating and not doing the job I want him to right now. Also, looks like we pockmarked the hell out of the area. Getting the mineable materials. So I will have to send somebody out sometime soon to fix that. I know he's working on it. Quit your bitching. So this is the artisan table. Requires a strong... Actually, a stone hammer also works. I'm not even sure what we need the artisan workbench for, to be completely honest. Alright, should have been constructed. Well, you're maxed out, so you better have enough inventory space to do it. She's on the way. Walker Boy is now level 13 Carpenter. Nice. He's getting there. Four more levels. We'll be able to construct the uh, most powerful bows. Oh, no. Wait, what? Oh, I see. I'm like, oh, God, a boar has died. Something must have murdered. Oh, wait, that was the boar I told him to kill. Never mind. Never mind. All is well. So we now have our castle gate, and it is beautiful. Alright, so, engineer, go back to blacksmithing, get all those torches constructed, especially now, because we'd like love to be able to see. Let's actually look down here now, we can probably see really well now that the uh, fireplaces, actually, surprisingly, the fireplaces do not appear to be giving off a lot of light. Uh, construction, no, objects, lighting. Cancel that. Wall sconce. Ah, deconstruct that. I'm going to move it. Okay. Ah, design. Objects. Storage. Treasure chests. Resources. Let's have two more get constructed. What the hell is this? Armor chest. Oh, it required the smith. Now we actually have the smith. She can go get that done. Yeah, let's go ahead and clear this so I don't have to keep constantly seeing that pop up. What is the stick up to right now? Ah, uh, he's finishing harvesting all the wool and such. At which point, well, this is good enough. Go back to that, my friend. Likewise, stonemason, go back to farming. So we now have an excessive amount of people doing everything. So, whereas before we were pretty much like a step away from just like losing completely, uh, we're in a much, much better position now, I have to say. For the moment, at least, we are in a much better position. So now it's mostly about making everything look lovely. Hmm. Ah, uh, the fuck? Apparently Emma is stuck inside somebody right now. <laughs> Literally. That is unfortunate. Resources, bricks, 
would help if I had the thing I need to produce that. Stone mason, sorry it's an orchid, I need to steal you again, even though I just had you go back to farming, I know I'm an ass like that, my apologies. And it looks like I've actually gone over the typical hour that I would. So yeah, now is the time where I can start to assign people almost completely to doing uh, military training tasks and such. So I get my archers training and now everyone kind of going at it. So that will be ready for the next major attack. But I think I'm going to have them do that next time. So we're doing pretty well at the moment. I think I will call this here. So next time around, we're going to finish our little entrance way here. So we're going to get that built up. I may get a smaller inner wall constructed here. Uh, along with another castle door, maybe even the arch door. Excuse me. That way we have double the protection. In case of enemy invasion. That still won't protect us against any sprued mothers, but at the very least we can do what we can. Sometime soon, uh, since most of our actual skilled workers are to the level they need to be, although we still have to get the carpenter up and so on and so forth, uh, we're probably going to start getting a bunch of people other than farmers working on training archery. I uh, will keep Stick as our main infantryman for the moment, but uh, if our food supplies continue to increase, which at the moment, raw resources... They're, they're getting there. They are increasing, so we should start to see more people flooding in. At which point, I will just immediately have them start working on archery. Uh, we got to get them armored properly in the brigantines or whatnot that uh, the tailor can make. Uh, if we can get her up level properly. We're still waiting on more fibers for that. And yeah, other than that, we'll have to see what happens. I might try working with some advanced stuff, even though there's not really too much... Uh, advanced stuff to work with there's of course the siege engine but i think besides that there really isn't anything else i can build uh other than decor items really such as statues and stuff requires level 11 uh honoring fallen heroes oh yes i definitely need many statues uh post banners and all sorts of stuff like that well we can make a well to access groundwater, even though we don't really use water for anything. <laughs> uh, I would like to get more saplings to finish planting all these trees. That would be nice. So we'll get a bunch of banners eventually. Put a bunch of stone benches around for people just to relax on. We'll try and beautify the place a bit. And we'll see how things go. So thank you for watching, everyone. Have a great one. And I will see you all next time. Dragon out.